Hey folks, hope you're all doing well. Uh, happy Force Friday or Rogue Friday or whatever we're calling it. I'm just going to go with Rogue Friday. Um, I just got back from Toys R Us. Um, There's about an hour drive each way, maybe 45 minutes each way from where I live. Um, no midnight releases here. I think there was one store in New South Wales that was opening at midnight for it for this for this year. So um, it meant I got a good sleep and I got up and had breakfast and could just take my time. I chucked a podcast on in the car and listened to listen to that on the way down. Um, but yeah, we've had some terrible weather here in Adelaide. Um, last couple of days, they're calling it the 50 year storm. Um, hasn't hit badly in my, as where I live in the Adelaide Hills as it has it like on the coastline. Um, the storm came straight off the west coast, so it's been pretty rough. Um, anyway, yeah, like I said, just got back from Toys R Us. My good friends at Russ, I got a bag of things. I'm pretty excited. Um, the one store that I went to last year for Force Friday, they were opening an hour early at 8 a.m. instead of 9 a.m. Um, I decided to skip that one. That was the furthest away. I've got three Toys R Us's in Adelaide, and two of them are about 45 to an hour, and another one's an hour and 10. So I went with another one. I just decided, no, nah, I'll go and wait for the 9 a.m. to open. And I'm glad I did, because apparently the one at 8 a.m., didn't have, they had the one six inch black series Gin Urso as well as they just stock, stocked up on the Ahsoka wave. So not very much Rogue One stuff there. They had all the three and three quarter inch stuff, but apart from that, not a lot else. Um, so I'm, I'm, I'm ecstatic. I got everything I wanted. They didn't have the exclusive hover tank driver. Um, I'm hoping that hits, hits at some stage. Um, I might try and get it for a decent price on eBay. Um, so that was the only bummer. I, w I wasn't sure whether it was going to hit in Australia. They probably would have advertised it online otherwise. So we'll see if that hits down here eventually. Because um, I'm, I'm excited about that figure. But I did get the rest. Um, I just finished yesterday picking up the first wave of the three and three quarter inch line um, for Rogue One. And the two Rebels figures that are in that as well. Um, they sort of slipping out all over the place. Um, the embargo was... Didn't, didn't matter to a some retailer, so I managed to pick all them up throughout the week. Um, so yeah, I just went out with the aim of getting the two packs and the Black Series, and I did exactly that. So, start off, got a Death Trooper. I got two Death Troopers. Um, I had to grab two, so I can't wait to crack these open. I'm going to have a little opening party. I'm going to put on Star Wars and just sit and chill out and have a coffee and open some figures this morning, so... K2SO. I'm really excited about this figure. Some people have been getting these for the last couple of weeks and like seeing around Instagram and these figures just look absolutely amazing. I can't wait to just get them out and have a have a play around. There's the other Death Trooper. Cassian Andor. He looks cool. I'm excited to crack this guy open too. He looks good. Pretty excited about these figures. Really excited. Um, I skipped on the Unmasked Kylo Ren. I got the Sandy at the exclusive one, so I decided to leave leave them for someone else. Um, give some give some other people some chances to get some figures. So and Jin. So that rounds out the Black Series. So again, up to date, awesome, so excited. Um, and I just got the Rogue One two pack. So I was going to get the one with Poe and the Snow Trooper from the Force Awakens, but I decided. Uh, the, I mean, they're a little bit pricier at Toys R Us, so I decided to leave them, and that one probably won't move very quickly, so I'll wait. But I got this two packers here with the uh, Shaw Trooper and uh, Moroff. Yeah, Moroff. I'm excited about these. I spotted these a week ago in a big W, um, but they wouldn't let me sell it. They wouldn't let me buy them. They didn't have them in the system, and they couldn't find anything to match them on. And... Um, yeah, the manager had to ring me back the next day and tell me that they were embargoed to the 30th. So, yeah, I knew that, but it was worth a shot. And I got Commander Powell and the Death Trooper in the three and three quarter inch. So that that's up to I'm up to date with the three and three quarter inch stuff now, um, which is awesome. I can just sort of sit back and save some money again, <laughs> get ready for the next lot. Um, also, last night, yesterday, when I was out, just getting a couple of figures. Um, when I was getting the other two I needed, I found I found like four during the, earlier in the week, and then I found two yesterday. And I also got the complete locations book, and this is this is absolutely incredible. Um, 
can't recommend this book enough. Found it at Big W for you Australians that are interested. Uh, 36 bucks. Um, I think Booktopia online, um, even with free shipping, it was going to be like $38. So I, I, was, I was so excited. I wasn't expecting to see it until the middle of next month. Um, but I did. Um, I found it. I'm excited. And I sat and read it for a while last night. And it's, it's a pretty standout book. I got the locations ones from episode one, two, and the original trilogy. And then they released a complete locations book when Revenge of the Sith hit, and I never picked that one up. So I've been waiting 10 years for an updated version. So very, very excited. Um, that's about it for now from me. Um, expect maybe some reviews. I don't know yet. I, I assume everyone's going to, if everyone gets these figures, everyone's going to be doing their individual reviews. So... I might just do some short videos based on what I think about them. I won't go into too much detail in terms of reviewing them. If if you want me to, tell me. I'll do it. I'll, I don't care. I'll, I'll be happy to. Um, but, um, yeah, that's about it from me, guys. I uh, hope you all have a fantastic Force Friday. Have a fantastic weekend. We've got a long weekend here in Australia, so we've got Monday off. It's our Labor Day, so exciting, exciting, exciting. Get some sleep-ins and more playtime. Anyway, guys, drop me a message. Find me on Instagram and Facebook and whatever, all that kind of jazz, jazz. So I'll speak to you all soon. Until then, may the force be with you.